Most of our life is a series of images. Daniel Henry Barrett, 26, died three years ago in a loft fire in Soho. Danny Barrett was D.H. Ruprecht. Sat next to a car holding a little boy's hand, but they're looking in opposite directions. Danny and Henry, right? That would be Danny's past. The second one is a young man and woman looking at each other. Which I'm guessing is Danny with Sarah, which represents his present. Now, take a look at the third one, Danny's future, the one that he sent to Henry. And remember what the curator said about hidden symbols. Well, Danny and Sarah are looking out. What is that? It's too hard to see. That's why I brought the original. They're looking way off into the distance at a, a tiny person? A baby? The best part of you lives in me. And the best part of both of us is my gift to you. That's Danny's future. I think Henry has a grandchild. Sarah? Wow, uh, I've waited for this moment for so long and now I don't know what to say. <laughs> Neither do I. Uh, there's somebody here who is demanding to see you. This is your granddaughter, Henry. You know, I'll be the rest of my life. They pass us by like towns on the highway. Dear Marie, it was incredible seeing you again, but I have to be honest, it was painful too. You spend all those summers and holidays, holidays with your best friend, and then she just disappears. Well, it's a hard thing to get over. All the stone lilies are gone. I want to break all the over. Yeah. Even when something tells you, against all common sense, that you have met the one you've been waiting for all your life. All my life. And then I let you go. Why did I let you go? Why did I let you go? Sometimes a moment stuns us as it happens. And we know that this instant is more than a fleeting image. words are those left unspoken. Dear Buzz, this is Samila, Sammy. Hope you remember me because I've never forgotten you. I have so many things to thank you for. First, I guess I, guess I should thank you for the socks. we may never see again, but all of them we shall love forever. spoke of those things as the sun came up on New Year's Day. And even if we can't keep dancing, I would like to keep that conversation going. Write to me. Yours, Jonathan. March 17th, 08. Dear Jonathan, I don't believe in coincidence or fate. I believe our lives have purpose and meaning. I believe... We know that this moment... Every part of it will live on forever. <laughs>